Aloha food lovers. Today I'm making you one of the cheeses that I use the most frequently in my kitchen. It's grated Parmesan. I'm making two kinds for you this afternoon, uh, block cheese and also the grated Parmesan. Let's get started. The first recipe that we're making is grated vegan Parmesan. You need five ingredients, cashews, nutritional dry yeast, garlic powder, sea salt, and Italian seasoning. And that's it. Sprinkle this on your favorite dishes and enjoy. The second recipe we're making today is the vegan cheese block. This recipe calls for a couple specific products. I really like to buy my products on Amazon. I found it's the most affordable way. I'm gonna go ahead and throw those links in the description box below and it'll take you straight to the products. For this recipe, we're using both cashews and sunflower seeds. The sunflower seeds really give it that parmy, salty taste. If you're going for a toasted Parmesan block, you can add miso. This gives it a richer flavor, but it will change the color. This next step is the most important part of the cheese making process. You're going to add your agar powder, one tablespoon to four tablespoons of coconut oil, and just mix it slightly three minutes on medium heat. The mixture of the agar powder and coconut oil is really important because when it mixes together and cools, it's gonna form that nice cheesy texture. Add the coconut oil to your blender and you're gonna blend until you get a doughy thick consistency. Make sure to place some saran wrap or oil in your mold so that the cheese comes out easily and place it in the fridge for four hours. I wasn't happy with the color of this block so I added a little bit of cream of tartar and just sprinkled it over top to give it the Parmesan look. And here you have it, the perfect cheese platter for your next party or event. No one's gonna believe this is vegan. If you make this recipe, post it on Instagram, hashtag vegan Aloha Kitchen so I can see how it turns out. Mahalo, and I'll see you in the kitchen. Hi guys, thanks for watching the video. I had so much fun making this one. If you liked it, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe so you can get access to all of my new content. Leave a comment below about what cheese you would like me to hack next. Mahalo, and I'll see you in the kitchen.